Now we can look at changing our channel brush. What we've done is just put the vehicle into brush service mode, which allow, relaxes the hydraulics on the channel brush and it allows us to pull the brush arm out. It keeps it suspended, which makes it easier to actually remove the brush. But we've got 413 mil bolts on our um, um, standard brush plate. The brush plate, as per usual, has got an elongated hole with a hole large enough in the centre for the bolts on the brushes to actually pass through. It's what's known as a quick release brush plate. So we have to loosen off all four bolts on this mechanism. Okay, so we've loosened them off enough now. What we need to do is turn the brush towards the, so the bolts go towards the centre hole and it should allow it to fall through. Be mindful these things are razor sharp and we don't want them catching our legs or our feet or anything. And that's it, that's the brush off. It should be noted as well, what we try and do is make sure the brushes go no shorter than the hand's width, 100 millimetres. Basically it protects the edge of the brushes and the edge of the brush plates against excessive wear against curb stones. While the brush is off, there's also a grease nipple underneath that only gets greased when the brush is off. We don't want to be putting our hand up underneath there, potentially causing injury to ourselves. And then when we put the new brush on, it's a reversal of that again. Line them up roughly because they're quite heavy. Again, we go in with our quick release brush plates, box round, slide it to the back. Should be noted on the outside of the machine, the bolt should always be at the back of the slot. And that will be the other way around because the brush plate turns the other way on the other side of the machine. What we do is we tighten up two opposites first and then we tighten up the other two. So just get it hand tight, bring it round. So we're doing the opposites to prevent any damage or distortion to the brush plate. And then we give it a final tighten on all four. Just ensuring once again the bolt is at the rear of the slot and it's nice and tight. Happy days.